Have you ever gotten a Snapchat from a girl? No. Anyways, let's talk about the controversy of whether or not a Tyrannosaurus Rex was a hunter or a scavenger. Now, what initially got this debate started in the first place was further analysis done on the skeletal structure of the Tyrannosaurus Rex. The legs really didn't favor it being like other theropods in the fact that it wasn't built for speed, clocking in at a max of around 25 miles per hour. So this got a lot of people questioning, well, if it's not built for speed, how on earth could it possibly hunt other animals? Now, there is evidence to suggest that it did scavenge for food, that being in the form of a very well-preserved hadrosaur. Now, the thing that made this hadrosaur fossil very interesting was all indications seeing that it didn't die in battle, but it drowned in water. Now, the thing that didn't line up with this hadrosaur fossil was one of the forearms seemed to sustain bite marks taken by a tyrannosaur species. The thing that didn't really add up was the fact that, well, if it drowned, how could it have had those bite marks? All indications seem to it being that it drowned in water, its corpse was buried, and one of the arms was exposed on the surface, and an oncoming tyrannosaur came along and started eating upon it. With those indications, paleontologists concluded that yes, it does in some instances scavenge for food. However, there's also another well-preserved hadrosaur that also supports the argument that it does hunt. One of the things that was found on another hadrosaur was the fact that it had a tyrannosaur tooth lodged in its vertebrae. And the strange thing about the tooth being lodged in the vertebrae was that everything around it seemed to kind of heal itself around it, meaning that a tyrannosaur species attempted to hunt a hadrosaur, but it was unsuccessful and the hadrosaur was able to get away. And seeing as it got away, the body would start to heal around the tooth that had broken inside of that vertebrae, indicating that yes, Tyrannosaurs do display hunting habits. Now the spectrum of whether it falls under more of a scavenger or a hunter, now that is impossible for us to determine. So if anyone ever does ask you though, whether a T-Rex was a hunter or a scavenger, you could say perhaps it was both, an opportunist that feasted upon the wounded and the young, much like carnivores of today.